Thanks for joining me. Today we're running a setup tutorial for Safer VPN. I will be purchasing, installing, and using Safer VPN, both my computer and my mobile device, to give you a better idea if this is the right fit for you. My name is Josh, this is VPN Video Reviews. Before we begin, I would like to say that the links that you're going to find here in the video and down below in the description are affiliate links, but I do keep them updated with the latest sales and promotions, so click to make sure that you're getting the best deal. If you'd like to jump ahead to a specific location, you can do so using the time markers you see here. So with that out of the way, let's get started. And here we are on my browser. I'm gonna go ahead and type in safervpn.com, which will direct me to their homepage. You've got two different buttons here. They've got the get 80% off today and then a start free button. I'm gonna show you both of them. First, the middle one, get 80% off. They're gonna show you all of the plans that they offer. They have a one month plan, a one year plan, and even a two year plan. All of these come with a 14 day money back guarantee. Some VPNs that I work with give 30 days, others give three. 14 is about a good happy medium. So back to the homepage, I'm gonna click on start free and it's going to bring me to a sign up page. I don't have to give them my credit card. I can try safer VPN for 24 hours completely free, no strings attached. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to click start your free trial. They send me to a confirmation page. If I go to my email, I'm going to click on complete your sign up on the email that they sent me. And that's it. It took all of 15 seconds and I am signed up. Welcome to the computer setup. From our confirmation page, I'm gonna click install the software and download now. Now the Safer VPN software thankfully isn't that large, only 10 megabytes. It's very quick to download depending on what speed of internet you have. Once it downloads, since I'm on a Mac, I'm gonna have to drag the software into my applications folder to make sure that it ends up there. Once I do that, I will open up all my applications um, and launch the Safer VPN app. Now they give a little tutorial. I'm gonna go ahead and skip that. If you wanna look at it, you can. But I will put in my username and password that I created just a few seconds ago. But here's the thing, and this is something that was um, hopefully just unique to me, but when I tried to do this with Safer VPN, it would not allow me to use the password that I had just created. So I went back to their homepage and tried to sign into my account there. And again, when I put in my password, it told me that my password was incorrect. This forced me to go in and reset the password that I had just created about 30 seconds to a minute earlier. Now, hopefully this is something that VPN has fixed or maybe it was just something weird about me and the way that I had set up things. I don't necessarily want you to take this as this is what's going to happen every time that someone uh, works with Safer VPN. But for me, this was my experience. I had to reset my password. And once I had saved those changes and gone back into the software and put in this new password, the login was great. And now that we're logged in, let's take a look at the software. On the right side, you can see a simple connect button. On the left side, all of the server options that we have from the most recommended to all the locations that they offer across the world. I'm just going to choose USA East and click the button to connect. And within a couple seconds, I am connected to the uh, USA East server, which is great. Let's go ahead and look at the settings on the right side. I've got various VPN protocol options from OpenVPN, L2TP, and PPTP, as well as descriptions. From from a general settings perspective, they don't offer too much. They're not bogging people down with a lot of different advanced options, which for an advanced user may be a turnoff, but for the average VPN user, that actually makes things very simple. I can view my account, I can look at all these other things, but the reality is the simplest thing I can do is go up into my toolbar and then find the location, let's say Japan that I want to connect to, click on it, and I am connected. That's all it takes. Now let's take a look at our mobile setup. I'm gonna be using my Apple iOS device. I'm gonna go into my app store and search for Safer VPN. Now obviously that's gonna be the first app that shows up and when I click get, I can download it and it won't take that long. Now here's the thing about the app is that you could, if you wanted to, just download the app and sign up through the app. But since I've already done that on their website, I can also just log in after I've opened the, the app here. So I'm gonna click on log in. I'm going to use the username and password that I created just a few minutes ago on their website and log in here to the Safer VPN app. 
Now that that's done, you can see that I can click on connect if I wanted to. On the right side, I have all of my different options. On the left side, I have all of my servers. Again, servers all across the world that I can choose from. And once I do that, it's going to ask me to, it's going to send me over to the iPhone settings where I'm going to add a VPN configuration. It really doesn't take that long. It sends me back and I will connect, let's say here to the USA East. Now, if you want to take a look over on the right side again, the settings is a little bit, um, well, to me, it's a little bit disappointing, but I think the reason is, is because I'm using the free version. Once I upgrade to premium, they will give me the option for different protocols and I will get three simultaneous connections. But in this case, since I am using the free version, that doesn't come with it. But that's it. It's very simple. Click, connect, and you're on. Hey, I hope you found this setup tutorial to be useful. Again, click here if you want to make sure that you're not missing out on any of the sales or promotions for Safer VPN. If you're still not convinced that Safer VPN is the right option for you, go ahead and check out a number of the other VPN setup tutorials that I have as well as reviews. There's also an FAQ page where I answer a lot of the frequently asked questions about setting up a VPN and even what a VPN is. Thanks for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up or share it with anybody that you think might find it useful.